Hi, this is Karen Riedel, and I'm doing this screencast to describe the process of getting started with your faculty annual report profile. You can find your faculty annual report by logging into MyUMBC and then choosing the Faculty Center under Topics. And in the Personal Profile section, you'll see links to your faculty annual report. These directions are for the legacy faculty annual report, not the new digital measures one. So if we click on the faculty annual report link, we'll be taken directly to the personal profile screen, which is the first screen in the faculty annual report. Check to see that your name is correct over here um, and spelled correctly. If it is incorrect or not completed, you can just put the cursor in the boxes and type or edit. Next, check to see if you're classified in the correct department. So your primary department should be listed here. If that's incorrect, click on the drop-down menu and choose the correct department. If you have a secondary or other department affiliation, choose them in the boxes here. In the section in the center of the screen, you need to check only the sections of the FAR that apply to you. You'll select the appropriate sections by clicking in the empty box next to a particular section. If something is selected for you that you don't need, then you can remove it from your um, choices. So just selecting or unselecting these check marks will uh, choose the sections that you need. By checking a section, you're telling the faculty annual report to track that section up here in the to be completed um, section or over here once it's done and you've marked it completed as those sections that are actually complete. If you're not sure whether a section applies to you, you can um, click on the section and a box will pop up, a pop-up window that gives a brief description of what that section is so you can find a little bit of information from it. Some sections have an asterisk next to them, and those sections just indicate that they are multiple entry sections in the FAR. Once you're done selecting the sections that apply to you, click the Apply Changes button, and you'll get a JavaScript uh, pop-up window, um, and you need to click OK, and that will apply those changes to your profile. You'll be able to see the changes up here under the To Be Completed section. If you decide that you don't like what you selected and you want to restore the sections that were selected before, you can come back to the Center section, hit the Reset button, and it will select only those items that were originally selected. You will need to choose Apply Changes again and click OK for those to then be um, saved in your completed section.